Hi everyone, hope you're having a great weekend. I'm Fox 61 meteorologist Ryan Brett and we are pretty close to a heat wave in the Hartford area. We hit 90 on Friday, 94 on Saturday and we'll be very close to 90 on Sunday. If we hit it, that will make it three days in a row of temperatures hitting 90, which is what you need to call it a heat wave. And we've already had two this year. They were much longer and much more oppressive heat waves uh, lasting six and nine days each. Worth noting, the fire danger is very high out there this weekend, which is really unusual for this time of the year. Usually once there are leaves on the trees and everything's greened up, there's not as much of a risk. But because it's been so dry, and we are now in this severe to extreme drought. It's like a tinder box out there. So fires, not any type of burning, not recommended on Sunday through the weekend. And if you're doing a bonfire in the backyard, even if you've got a fire pit, be very, very careful given how dry it is out there. Morning temperatures, upper 60s to around 70, a very humid start to the day. And then we'll have a mix of sunshine and maybe mainly high level clouds, which will kind of filter out the sun in the afternoon. Forecasting 90 for Hartford and Windsor Locks, 86 in Meriden. Not quite as hot at the shoreline with a sea breeze, but it will be very humid along the shoreline on our Sunday. 83 in Hammonasset and Madison, 79 at Ocean Beach, a southeast wind coming in between 5 and 10 miles per hour. Uh, not nearly as warm for Monday. Temperatures in the 70s with more clouds and some rounds of showers. Actually, we need the rain, so we'll take it, especially on a Monday. Once the weekend is over, we'll really take the rain. You can see the timeline here. Six in the morning, a batch of some rain to our south. This may work in through the middle of the day with a couple of downpours, too, and then scattered showers through Monday evening. So it's not a washout of a day, but hopefully we can get some decent downpours in there, which would really help in this drought situation we're in. Another chance for showers and storms on Tuesday, but these will be more scattered hit and miss. So you'll have to get lucky to get anything out of that on Tuesday. And after that, high pressure builds in for the rest of the week. It looks dry and warm to hot. We'll probably be up around 90 again for Thursday and Friday. So here's a look at the rain chances. We're dry for Sunday, higher chances for rain Monday and Tuesday before we dry it out for the end of the week. So inland, we're around 90 on Sunday. If we hit it in Hartford, that's three days in a row. Cooler for Monday, but very humid with more clouds and a chance for showers. A little bit warmer with some peaks of sun Tuesday, but scattered showers and storms possible in the afternoon. And there's the heat that comes back for the end of the week, around 90 inland and mid to upper 80s at the shoreline.